I think, why would you then? Because there's, it's no secret that when she came over here, if you, if she's, you know she can't talk on the mic yeah. in, in English. You've known this. Okay, why are you building her up to be this unstoppable machine in NXT and only to have it So she go wouldn't away? have to talk. But at the end of the day, NXT is a smaller demographic than the other two. Uh, true. And it might have worked over there. I'm, but not, why? I'm not saying they always do this because they do screw up bringing people out from NXT. They do screw all the time. All the time. All the time, but they but screwed the up here time, again. But at the same time, it also could have been something they built up in NXT that didn't transfer over well. I just think she didn't transfer over well. You you, you can go in-ring product, everything else, but if you look at it from a perspective of trying to sell a character and things like that, she does not she does not come across. And I like Asuka, I but too. she does not come I, across well just, on television. She might not just be suitable for that audience. She was the queen of NXT. She might not be the queen of Raw or SmackDown because that's the way they booked her. But it could be. It might not be the booking. It could be just the audience. No, that not is the booking. It. it is. A, it, it is the booking. That's what. That's how they presented that character. Okay, she was still undefeated the first six months on the main roster. Yeah. How'd they book her wrong yeah, there? They didn't, they didn't do anything until she moved they, to SmackDown. Yeah, yeah. She, they booked her. They booked her. They booked her. They booked her. On top of a butt saw on the main roster. Then she won the Royal Rumble. Boom. Another huge mom- right. mo- momentous occasion. She doesn't translate. We can't do this. They pulled the plug on it at WrestleMania. So it took him, so it took him six, six months. So it took him six months to realize that she doesn't she connect. Had run, she I had think had that's through. a horseshit answer. Why do you say she that? Had it's through. a horseshit. Then, then there's no. Should they have known in a month? How do you know in a month from four shows? You don't. You mean to tell me She's, it takes you? It takes you six months to realize she can't. How talk many people on a have come over from? She anywhere. can't talk on a microphone. Um, so so now uh, it sounds like you're backtracking. So we're still gonna have her win. So now it sounds uh, like you're backtracking on what you just said. How many people have come over? It's what it sounds like. And they get this huge ovation, a huge pop for two months, and then they fizzle out. How but it many? wasn't fizzling out. Why did they? Th- it wasn't. It wasn't fizzling out. To you, to me, it was boring as shit. And I like it Asuka. Ba- it wasn't. Ba- I was sick of seeing her win every fucking week. The same shit. The same shit. Never talking. Never getting into the character. Well, first off, they shouldn't have had her go undefeated in NXT. That was a huge mistake because it handcuffed, bu- uh, supposedly handcuffed booking and what they could do with her on the main uh, on, the ma- on, on the main roster. That much I uh, I will give you. However, if it takes you. Uh, how long has she been here? Uh, two, uh, year, two years. Two years. Ish. If it takes you two years to realize, well, she can't talk on the microphone. Um, how many talent? Seriously? How much talent has it taken to figure that out? How many other wrestlers have that happened to? It, that they were pushing and pushing and pushing and went nowhere. How many? Hundreds. Hundred because they book them like shit. You mean tell me that Bobby Roode isn't a, how they're booking him isn't a mistake? I agree with you on that one. However, how many, people have come over, how many people have come over and just don't translate well? They don't translate well because they it's book not, them it's, like it's shit. It's the booking. How, how, how is it not the booking? Those are the people that write the How many people have come over, did their fucking little stint, their, their promos, and can't talk or can't get across? You don't feel them. That's and it, has, it doesn't have to do with the booking. It has to do with the character. Yeah, Bobby Roode's super boring on the mic. I don't care how they book and him. Was, book him to win, I, lose, or draw a match. That dude's super outside boring Outside of when he was mic. in Beer Money, super and James boring. Storms carried his ass, he was boring as fuck then, too. No. Yeah. No. And I watched, no. and I used to watch NXT, or uh, TNA. TNA then. I never liked, I like James Storms. I think you're letting booking more. off the hook. You're letting booking off the hook for the mistakes you that they've done. You can't blame booking for 900% of what's wrong with the WWE. Oh, you yes, you no, you oh yes, you can. Oh, yes, you can. Don't even get me oh, going that, on that. That's horrible. That's, that's bullshit. That's that is horrible. bullshit answer. Round two. Booking, you booking is just... Everything that's wrong with the WWE, I'm booking. Absolutely, you can. You're not going to anything on talent? That's what. That's how they're presenting the talent. The talent's being told what to do every second of the time that they're there. They're told do this, do this, do this, do this. They don't have the. And some the, people the, can make it work, and some people can't. It looks like shit on TV. Are you kidding me? It's not. I, I'm not debating the fact that booking's not a problem, but it's not 100 percent of the problem. 
It's not 100% of the problem. However, and they, some superstars just don't carry over. They don't. Not everybody's going to be John Cena. Not everybody's going to be. They're not transcendent stars. Yes, they they, 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 they don't shine. Through. But they can. But they can put them in spots where they can succeed, and they're not doing. So push somebody that can't get over. She Look is. At Roman she Reigns. was she over. Move. She was over. She was in NXT. She she was that over on the main roster. Is she? For I, like don't know. I think that, I think she was. For like two minutes because she came out and she did her mask dance, and then she put on one move and won the match in four seconds. Who the fuck cares? That's Ooh. what they did with Ryback, and they did. And, and look at Ryback, he, awful. Look, look, he didn't transition that either. He was a bum. Well, he was a, he, he, he was not transition at all. Look but, at Bo Dallas. Bo Dallas was shit until he became. Misraj. And uh, hold on, hold on. Now, now, so they're booking him better then. They're booking him, but it's also exactly. If he was, exactly. But if he was they, exactly. If he they're booking him, him to the point where they're putting him in a, in a spot the where he can succeed. Better, that's on him. That was a shitty gimmick. Are you kidding it was, me? But how did many he shit, come up with that gimmick? How many shitty gimmicks have we seen that still worked? B team. It's a shitty gimmick, but it works. The B, the B team was different. How? How so? It was, I, I would say, well, it, you know what? It wasn't even different because the, because they because they've tried that shit before. But it took uh, Bo Dallas's kid. Bo Dallas is much better on the mic than he was ever given credit for. That that that, that gimmick that he had, the Bo Leaf shit. Yeah. I thought it was funny in the beginning, but it. They booked him to the point where of, of nausea with that shit, with, with that, with that crap. Not everything is booking. A lot of some of it's character. Then what do you? Some get? people just can't pull off a goddamn character. How many times did Steve Austin change Hold his on. character? Hold How on. many times? And that was when they could do their own shit. Yeah, when he said Austin three sixteen to, to kick your ass, that's when shit took over. Yeah, but and that's when they wrote. He was the ringmaster. How many other things? Stunning Steve. How many other things was he before he found that right gimmick? The Hollywood and that Blondes. Was before they booked the shit out of everybody. They okay, so they found something. How many people was they found? They found a character. Hold on, they found a character. They found a way to book it, and they made money on it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay. They found something in the B team that seemed to have worked. In the beginning, it was like, eh, maybe, maybe not. But they found but something. They the right characters and it, for that. But they, if you can't, but again, if you can't sell but, that character, it's not just booking. If you can't sell that character, but it's again, you. but again, it, you have, you have booking, you have booking, your character. booking, and script writing all have to come together and work as one. You have to put your talent in the spot that they can succeed. They found but something the char- in Bo Dallas and the B team that works. Yes, because of their characters, because of who they are, because they believe what because they're doing. If you don't like your character and you don't like what you're doing and you half-ass it, that's part of the fucking problem, not just booking. No, no, that is booking because they're putting him in a, in a spot where they're not going to succeed, and they still, and they still. But these assholes sign with the WWE knowing this ahead of time that they're going to be put in these positions, correct? That Maybe. We, we book you and we make oh, you no, your no, character. No, 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 no. See, they get them to believe, oh, yeah, we'll believe? make you a star. We will make you a star. It's fine and dandy. But let's say, hey, yes. I want to you $100,000 a match, whatever the hell it is. You have to be this character. If you're not vested in that character, that character is not going to succeed. No matter what they book you, they can put you against friggin' John Cena every night and make you win every night, and you're still not going to pull it off. First off, you have to if it's not working, you're not you going to get to wrestle John Cena. That's good. You know, I'm going to hit you with a chair. <laughs> you have to be the character. If, if The Undertaker half-assed it, do you think The Undertaker would have been anything? Undertaker wrote itself as soon as he walked out of the car. But if he sucked, if he was the worst fucking wrestler on the, on the, on the roster, and he couldn't pull off the dead man, he would have never become what he became. Again, did. you're talking about Steve Austin. That Steve was Austin a perfect, the Undertaker was a perfect storm. That yes. was a perfect storm that what wrote about itself the fake for five years. What about the fake Razor Ramon? Oh, sorry. But you have to believe the character. If you're half-assing your character, you if, if you're half-assing a job, it's not going to be believable enough to get over. So first off, well, hold on. If, 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 you, if you believe somebody is half-assing a character, okay, then why don't you fire them? They probably will be fired. No, they can fire. They can fire anybody anytime they want. Why, Cause they why put, didn't they fire Bo Dallas then? Because they put money behind them. Why, why didn't I fire Curtis Axel? How many people have gone back from 
Because you're, because they're the daddies. Of being off the show, being back on the roster. You, How you, many people have done that? You're naming the B team. They're daddies. Yeah, daddies. Yeah. You, you, you know, yeah. and and okay, he Bo, Bo Dallas bought into the Bo Leave gimmick, right? He milked that thing as far as he could go. It was a shitty gimmick. It was shitty gimmick. Curtis Axel was a shitty gimmick. Yep. You know, he was a jobber to the stars, whatever the hell he was. He was awful. You know, but but they didn't but 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 they, but they fucking worked their but, ass but, off. But they it. they didn't get fired because they were company guys. They stayed within the system, and and it took it bided their time, and they fell into something that now works for them. Right. Correct. How many people have worked their way up because of how good of a worker okay. they are? Okay. Okay. How, how about Rusev Day? How long was he dicked around because he was boring as hell? Yeah, he's still he boring. He wasn't. Without Aiden English, he's still boring. Exactly. Because he had Lana, that was the only thing that got him over, was Lana, because okay. she was hot. Yeah, and she was cool okay. when she actually spoke Russian. Yeah, she now, was like, Russian. Russian. she's American. Is she Russian? American. Is she American? And she's got sure. these really blonde patches here that annoy the shit out of me. I don't know what the, the hell that is. The Russian accent scene tends to leave. 